Ooh, 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 ooh. It just I'm nice. <laughs> yeah, definitely helps if you guys can actually see what I'm doing. Uh, let's see, we've got an alert here on. Oh, it's the Atli. Oh well, my beloved Atli. So the bot is up and running at the moment, folks. So if you're trying to chat, it'll take about 45 seconds before the bot kicks off. Since we have the new Siri bot, no, Siri bot, Siri bot, I don't know what it is, but it prevents the hate raids. Yay. So, Ed, I made a list <clears throat> of all of my tunes. I won't show this to you. I made a list of all of my tunes and where they are on everything. So, I realized I have 23 tunes, of whom one, two, three, four, five, six of them. Seven of them have done all of the story episodes. <laughs> I have done all. Um, I have done, um, except the, those I had missed, I had done all story episodes, but on different tunes. Not one tune that has done everything. That's what I want to do. I want to get all my tunes all the way through everything. And most of them are up to the Civil War, Klingon Civil War. And I have one who's a new tune, who's only through Cutting the Cord, which is one of my favorite episodes. But unfortunately, it's a solo play episode. I think it's solo play. That's the one when you're... Um, oh, God. I think you have to kill Hakiv, and you've got the map that's three-dimensional, so you have to go up and down and around the stairs and the buildings. I think of the cord. Mm-hmm. And it's back. Is it Romulan Mystery? Let me see. It's, an it's early... Romulan Mystery. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's actually one of my favorite episodes. It's the make good for having to have played the Coliseum right before that. <laughs> because Coliseum sucks. Actually, Coliseum, I just played it again the other day, and it wasn't as bad this time, I think, because I learned just not to listen to Slomic. He's just, ah. Uh, yeah, uh, kind of, uh, Slomic, oh, put the sock in it. Exactly, yeah. that's exactly it. And by the way, good morning, Kadargo, how are you today? Yeah, so it, once I learned to just not listen to him, it's not bad. And if you go back and do it when you've got decent weapons, it's definitely not bad. You can just kind of fly through it and shoot the heck out of everything. So I don't have a lot exciting today. I have destroys and Kathy ships in space, but not necessarily in Kankra. I have defeat Tholian Zanukara, and I have defeat Vath in the ground battle zone. And on my other account... Let's see what's on the other account today. Maybe there's something exciting there. And on the other account, we've got... No, no, no. I don't want to make a new character. Thank you. I've got, oh, defeat Mortholians on the crown, a Lucari TFO, and an Icon two Iconian TFOs. Ooh. That's, um... Okay, um... Ooh. Or we could do something else entirely, and I can do this this evening. I'll repent space. Hmm? Ooh, Plasma that's... damage ground. Tholians on Nukara. What is it with Tholians on Nukara? Yeah, that is uh, just uh, go there and... Uh... Yeah, I have a certain spot that I like to go, but I won't go at this time of the day because it'll be everybody there. But it's on the second level, just towards the um, path that leads back up on the far east side, I want to say. For some reason, the Tholians love to spawn there, so I go down there with um, Gorny, 
and I'll drop the crystal prisms and you know crystal prisms lightning and uh, agony field yeah it's 10 folians so the green one so but it's so overkill I have 60 <laughs> Uh, uh, hey, Katargo, yeah, I have an F2 uh, free-to-play as well, so does Ed. Ed. You've got at least one free-to-play, right? Do you have more than yes, that? Yes, that's... Um, I have one uh, one clean free F2-play. Mm -hmm. That's uh, uh, where Captain Cuddles is, and it's also Mort, one, ah, of, my, yeah. the, the, one of my best... Uh, best chips and stuff, uh, some uh, duties, and um, e I have done many good experiments and good experiences with, with the free-to-play, so uh, I uh, <clears throat> I stick to, uh, stick to that. Yeah, there are some definite advantages in the pay-to-play ones, but the biggest one being the stupid auto refining of the dilithium. Yeah, but, uh, okay, um, at number one is a lifer, and of course uh, that's cool for him. Mm -hmm. And um, at number three it says, um, I get everything for free and get gifts, and everything is a gift. <laughs> well, Brando Mugi is my free account. As should be, because she's Ferenki. Um, and Brondo Mom is the life of her account. Do, 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 do. Let's see if there's anything we want to get rid of there. Uh, that's where they are. Okay. So what shall we do today, Ed? What shall we do? Yeah. By the way, I, go ahead. I think um, you uh, St. Catherine ground and na na na. I repair space. Bleh. Hack frigates. <laughs> uh, no, nothing appealing. Yeah, no, nothing appealing today. I mean, I'll do it, but I can do it when I'm having dinner tonight or something like that. Okay, um, I would say um, <clears throat> let's do the Nukara uh, ground thing with the uh, Tholians. Okay. And um, just have to put something into equipment. Yep. Our scouts have found an attack element of the Zinkethi fleet. We need to know what they're up to. As your ship is the closest, I'm giving the honor of intercepting the Zenkethi to you. However, both the Most next and big and thing is get to fast if you wish to beat Martok and Kern to the get to Nukara. I use the shortcut on spin the wheel. And that gets spin me pretty close. Yeah, that'll take yeah. you to Drizana. That will be the. Uh, my, I will do it with my uh, temporal guy, mm -hmm. who uh, has not uh, explored the the extra story arcs yet. Hasn't even been on my favorite Nimbus tour course. So. I haven't done Nimbus for a while. I actually have a tune who I don't think has done Nimbus. Kadargo, I also made a Tellerite, but mine's name is Grunty. A highly, um, uh, a much love uh, Telluride on, um, on ad number three. Free ad? It's Miss Money Pig. <laughs> oh! Somebody was the asking. Science Lady. Yeah, Dante was asking about Miss Money Piggy the other day. Uh, last night, actually. And he couldn't remember who Miss Money 
Piggy belonged to? And I said, that's Ed. He goes, I thought it was Ed. Yes, and she, uh, she is in command of the USS Janeway. <laughs> it's, um, it's a fleet long-range science vessel. So the very classic Voyager in free-to-play um, going for legendary ships is way too much work for me at least. I know people have done are doing that, but uh, I can. Uh, so it's kind of a free-to-play, um, relaxed, mostly, often. <laughs> On my way to nuke Ara. Who was Ara that we nuke him? Better than the old Kara. New Kara, old Kara. Oh yeah. Cool puns on foliage. Because of the timing on trying to do the 20 hour cooldown for the maximum dilithium. I ran Firewall and Jabberwocky on a bunch of tunes yesterday since I was out sick. So now, you know, time comes that I have to turn it and turn on the computer, wait for the computer to warm up, log into the game, click, click, done, log back out. So much easier for those things. Doesn't look like we have multiple instances. Yeah, there's just the one instance. I see you. We both of us run the commonly approved uh, black suit from the nice. Yeah, Step absolutely. Between stars. This is my marksman. So I've been very slowly cleaning out all my excess stuff, which I know is amazing. I'm cleaning out stuff. Yeah. And here you see my temporal agent. Did you beam down? I'm here, but it may be on a different instance. Unless it may be added an instance. Nope, I'm just showing the number one instance. I'm up at yeah. base camp. Base camp. I don't see you. Ed, where are you? Uh. That's weird. I see Horace here, but I don't see Ed. Definitely. Yeah, that's weird. We are on the same map. Okay. It's confusing. Nick. Yes, it is. Okay. Um, I just uh, go to Camp Alpha. Okay. And start shooting. How many do you have to kill? Ten. <laughs> yeah. I'll go down to Bravo so we don't overlap. Excuse me? Sorry, sorry, sorry. So I run through the fields of pyre. In the right spot? Yep, there it should be. Up here in my favorite spot. I forgot I had to use Lex throwing knives. Still was throwing knives at things.
Let's see, I've got half of mine. What? What do you mean, what? I have 60 to kill, it takes a few minutes. Did you get your 10, I presume? Uh, I had got my 10 and now uh, just uh, have completed the plasma damage. Uh, Excellent. On ground. Uh, so, some box less to uh, put into the account bank. Because um, Recruit will collect the lithium as, uh, as if he were Berserk. That's how recruits uh, go along. <laughs> um, so I uh, do the endeavors with a recruit. Yes. Uh, where I get the uh, experience points I need for specialization stuff and uh, then put the boxes into the account bank where mm -hmm. another toon collects. Uh, if there's a delicium, then find for another toon. I tried that to do does the same not thing. Collect yeah. Um. Let's see, I've got 11 to go here. And one more to go. And come on, die. Die, 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 die. Now it's a matter of picking up all the loot. Well timed. My Alachi Walker just died. Come up here to my little hiding place. Stop shooting me. I'm hiding. Yeah, I have a recruit on this account, but I think she finished up the tutorial and nothing further. Um, <clears throat> so far, when I went along uh, with my recruit, um, the only thing that felt a little bit different to what I was used to was the Dyson story arc, you are required to do the little mission. Uh, so it's uh, the tower control in the uh, contested zone. That was the, mm -hmm. uh, something that uh, I uh, think other recruits had not to do, but you have. But on the uh, bright side, um, <clears throat> It seems they uh, finally fixed the uh, bug in on Kobali Prime, where at the uh, where there is uh, the mission uh, where you have to uh, return to a um, base camp, and there is no um, mission point circle on the map. That oh, mission yeah. point circle now is there, so it's not. Uh, you, you get shown stuff and also um, in also another thing repaired was um, when you do butterfly 
Yes. And have the Romulan uh, holodeck simulation. Mm -hmm. The Teleron uh, chamber now is lit brightly, and you see the NPC you otherwise might lose in the dark then and now, because where is he? At? I see nothing. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah. Actually, I was running the new mission on my laptop, and the opening sequence when you beam it down to the ship, or actually to the base, um, the power is out. So you can, on my regular monitor, I can see where I'm going, but on my laptop, it's like, what? Huh? I can't tell if I'm left, right, up, down. It's almost impossible until you get the power restored. So that's that's really annoying. So I have to play that one at night on my laptop. Because it's the only time there's enough contrast. So, but it works fine on this machine. I think I know why my monitor keeps going out. And the temporal agent already is a hoarder my way. That is, <laughs> I have plenty. Yeah, my, my bank is um, stacked with provisions I need for the duty of his mission. Yes. And also with um, mission loot, I just don't want to drop because I might find use for it. That's the way I feel. You know, I've got stuff. People are like, you're a hoarder. No, no, I'm just hoarding things. I don't know. I've got a lot of stuff I've <laughs> never used. On um, was it? Battle Mom. I went through the inventory, cleaned out everything, went to the shipyard, figured out which ships I'd never opened up which is a lot easier on this account, tossed or dry docked everything else, opened up all the ships, and I will dedicate one ship to a weapon type. So I will have a Polaron, I'll have a Tetrion, I'll have a AP, a Phaser, Disruptor, and one will be dedicated to each. But that takes time to do that. And yep. obviously it takes cool. some money. Yeah, well, I thought I'd use my reputation stuff rather than going out and buying a ton. And then if I particularly like something, then I might start doing that. I'll start doing that with all of them, so I'll eventually open up all of the dozens, if not hundreds, of unboxed ships that I've got. But I do have a bunch of unboxed ships. Yeah. But it's, it's, I know a year ago, well, not a year ago, two years ago, I was able to play a lot more than I am now, courtesy of going back to working full-time, which, you know, makes, makes me rethink, you know, do I really want to work full-time or do I want to retire? But paying my bills is kind of nice. Not living on credit cards is really nice. And then I get to a nice, comfortable financial place and something happens. It's just like, ah, uh, something always happens. Let's get rid of some of this stuff here, though, so people can't tease me as much tonight. I do want to dedicate one tune to just being kind of a storage shelter of stuff. Um, that works until you have three of them and get lost again. <laughs> yeah, well, there is that, yes. Do you, I need... I got my soul and a marksman, right? Right? I do. I do not need you, then. Yeah. Oh, I'm looking forward to the upgrade weekend coming. Yes, yes. I wish it was last weekend, because I was home last weekend. Oh, it's, uh, you have to do your upgrading in a, a first day night fever. Oops, let's toss 
that out while I'm at it. Yeah, oh, actually, uh, yeah. problem with Thursday night is Wednesday night is so long, though this week won't be quite so bad. But I don't get home from Taekwondo until, or Hapkido until between 11 and 12, and I still have to get up at 4.30. And yeah. then by Thursday night, it's catching up to me, and then Friday morning, I'm feeling lousy, and I have that four-hour drive. Ugh. Yeah, um, for you, you would need your weekends Monday to Wednesday. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Having yesterday as a sick day was really helpful. But I can't do that. Yeah. Yet. I mean, I'm, I would love to pitch that to my boss. How would they feel about um, a four-day we work week? Still, you know, 10 hours a day or something, but... Uh, you know, sitting yeah, in the uh, office is just like, oh, painful. Oh. Well, I mean, you just sit there, and sometimes there's nothing, nothing to do. So I've been doing a lot of extra classes. So it alternates between absolute panic and not enough to do. Oh. So on this account, Cadargo, my banking tune is... Who I haven't finished bringing up. Oh, did I not... I didn't make a banking tune on this one yet. Uh-oh. I'm going to have to make a banking tune over here. Well, given how fun it is to have the new Klingons, I might repurpose Karen to be my banking tune, but... So I have two temporals and two... Or sorry, a temporal? Nope, Karen's my only Klingon. No, Cappuccino's my Klingon. Yeah, I could repurpose uh, Karen to be my banking tune. I'm sure she will complain to her manager. <laughs> yeah, but nobody's going to argue with her when they come to take money out. So I have two TFOs left on this account. We're going to ignore that one. We'll handle TFOs tonight. And do I have anything over here that's fun? So I've been working for quite a while on building up a torpedo build on the uh, jellyfish, but I'm still not sure if I want to do torpedoes or if I want to do cannons. I love cannons, and this ship is so maneuverable. It seems silly not to use her when I can. Yeah, either torpedoes or cannons. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, either torpedoes or cannons, one or the other. Right now, I've got her with, um, it's an all torp build, nothing else. I've got Delphic, a Kelvin Timeline, Neutronic, Enhanced Biomolecular, Dark Matter, and a Gravimetric Photon. But I've also got a couple others in reserve, the Quad Micro Photon Torpedo, which I was not impressed with, and the Trilithium Tricobalt. But to make it work, I've got to have everything else built to go with it, and therein, therein lies the problem. It's I need some time to just dedicate to that Zen moment of getting that done. Apparently, I've got to turn in a bird on Risa. Oh well. Name her Polly and keep her forever. <laughs> I could do that, yes. Let's see, consumables. No. One of us has to go in and clean out all this stuff one of these days. Oh, we're talking about having a fleet party, folks. Fleet party, cool. We haven't had a fleet party uh, since the beginning of the year. Colony. Oh, we could do it at the oh. colony. Can we do, uh, yeah, the colony upgrade. That was our last Yeah. Party. 
And then because I'm never home on the weekends, except when I'm home on the weekends, I've got stuff to do. I've always got stuff to do. Might have to add some spots to my uh, account bank here. Well, what should we do, Ed? We've got about half an hour before I have to traipse off to work. We could run some missions. We could level up some of your ships. Um, uh, let me check something, then I... Then I can tell. I currently have a Herogen Heavy Hunter that I've never used. I found something. Okay, what did you find? No need for temporal operative lobby suit. I have a Breen suit from the winter event ah. uh, when it these days 300 lobby in the shop but I had I had still in my deep stock in the secret vault beyond Zurich. <laughs> it's not hoarding. It's not hoarding. Not these ones and now there is only one left uh, in and what is that? Okay, it's uh Okay, that's just a scarf. And another uh, another dress for a winter event. But that means uh, my temporal agent will go to, uh, to something uh, looking uh, strange, distinctive, and rarely seen, and colorful, and turn it into Greetings. There's something that you? looks entertaining. Um, One thing. Um, I have seen uh, there has been great despair. What shall we do with the uh, infected conduit? Um, but actually, I have that uh, mission on my uh, at number one. Oh no! How terrible! Whatever yeah, shall we do? So I would switch um, to a uh, to one of my Federation chars there and would enjoy doing it. I would be happy to do that. Let's see. What do we need? Oh, we definitely need some discovery. Can you give me one second? Okay, Cadargo. Yeah. Hold on. Cadargo has ponied up from Mom Cleans Her Pockets. Cadargo, that means you get pick, to pick one thing from my inventory for me to pitch. Okay. Scotchy, check your traits. Let's see if I can move this up a little bit here. There we go. That's everything in my inventory. Pick one thing. I'll be right back. I'm just going to grab a sweater. Everything in place. Awesome. Hey, Ed, did I ever show you the vests that we made for Vegas? I recall a photo from okay. uh, that, that you had take uh, had passed to Kel and Kel passed it to the world where I, I saw the uh, yes biker the space bikers yes space bikers that's exactly it does that suffice for you Kadargo I have pitched my tribbles both of them I only had two. Okay, 
So, Cadargo has made me throw away my triples. They are gone. Yeah, um, I really enjoyed making those. There are people who make, this is really weird, but they make leather jackets, or they paint leather jackets for brides to wear over their wedding dresses, because apparently that's a thing these days. And, you know, they're painted with beautiful flowers and things like that. But I'm still thinking, you know, flaming targ on the back of your leather vest over your wedding dress. I think that sends a good message. Wow, there is a ton of noise here. We live next door to the back of a grocery store. And by law, they're not supposed to ha make noise before 7 a.m. But when it's just a truck moving in and out, like they're doing right now, if you complain, the police are like, by the time we get there, the truck will be gone. So we're not going to come out. Ugh. So what's the point? And of course, most people compensate by closing their windows. <laughs> I'm not closing my windows. Yeah. So if you invite, uh, I will invite you and we do, uh, do a infected convoy. Okay. Yeah, I'll try it out on this ship. That should be interesting. Or I can invite you. F ma sending. This will be a good test for the ship. See how she's doing. Yeah, I suppose I can upgrade these torps. But just in case... Ooh, I've got ultimates on this one. Oh, and they're bound to account, not bound to character. <gasps> ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. We Q. We woo. There we go. Yeah. Universal Endeavor, always great, always great to do things. <clears throat> With a few exceptions, there's some that if you don't get them the first day by day two, people are just like, eh. But this one, this one, you know, it's such a challenge. Everybody just <sighs> decides not to do it because it's so hard to do infected conduit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, last night we're like, oh no, infected conduit. How terrible. Whatever shall we do? So, Ed, I've got one of my things for today for my endeavors. Destroy Zinkethi ships, but not in Gankra. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I told you this, but do Scylla and Charybdis because the protomatter torpedoes count as Zinkethi ships. The situation is grim. All it, there's more. Begin. And if you're really lazy, don't destroy the ships. Just wait for them to launch the torpedoes, take out the torpedoes, sit back and wait a while. I did Kadargo. I haven't heard any details. Let's see if I've got any cool stuff to launch on this one. I did not mean to do that. Oh well. Did 
Definitely don't have enough saves on this ship. weird. Ah, I see somebody went over and did right side first. Yeah, um, a bad habit I uh, should get lost off. Oh, is that you? Yeah. Boimler might be a good one for a torpedo build. Alright, let me see what I can find on that information there. Jeff Bezos Blue Origin announced Monday that actor William Shatner, 90, will be on the next Blue Origin flight alongside Audrey Powers, Vice President, blah, 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 blah. On October the 12th, that's next week. Ooh, 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 ooh that could be cool. William Shatner in space! You still there, Ed? Yeah. So, if you were given I the opportunity... I think you will be a very happy old man. <laughs> yeah, really. I'd go. I'm not old yet, but I'd go. Well, um, I would prefer to buy me a house instead. Okay, yeah. I mean, if, if it's one or the other, yeah, a new house would be much better than going into space. But it still would be really cool to go to space. Yeah. <clears throat> I see, I see you have cool stuff in your inventory. I'm going to get rid of some of it. Anything in particular in there? I have tons of stuff. Uh, 
not nothing. Uh... I have the two ultimate plasma that I think might be yeah, nice for some build. Some of those uh, progress um, acolyte uh, uh, boosters between the um, R and D boosters. So. Uh, Counting probably fifth line from the bottom, second from the right. Fifth line from the bottom. One, one down. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I just took them out of my uh, in, um, shared account because I need some space in there and threw them over here for the moment. Mm -hmm. But normally I throw those into my uh, account. Yeah. Um, your record has to do... Uh, DOF progress and getting six DOF uh, sections to ten. Mm -hmm. uh, any booster would help, uh, so give them, give those to him. I will do that. Let's get over to the account. Uh, yeah, I have to pull something out to put something in. Uh, nobody needs one thousand infinity lock boxes. Yes, yes, I absolutely need one thousand infinity. <laughs> <laughs> there. Now the other guys can use those. Oops, there's a little space left. Put those back over there. I must go to go to the account bank with now Mr. Carlson and go to and then go to the tailor. Cause there is now my brainy outfit. I have a couple of tunes who have got some of the Terran weapon agony face or Terran Empire agony phaser weapon boxes. Terran weapon agony phases. Well, it been I thought it might be a fun build for one of my tunes if I can get enough to equip a ship. Uh huh. Um, Dodging phases. Yeah, I just thought it might be fun. You know, try yeah. something different. Same with the ultimates, put those in there. <laughs> Abda says going to space is akin to Shark Week. It's fun to watch somebody else do it. I don't necessarily disagree, but I would still go. I have some leftover keys here. How interesting. I didn't know I had leftover keys. Perhaps I should take... Oh, that needs to go to somebody else. Anyway, let's take those out for a moment. Where are my keys? Let's put the keys in there. And let's go grab Kethfa, because she's the one who's getting the Omni that you gave me. Yeah, that was kind of... Um uh, some, uh, some of my fellow, fellow players was looking for an Omni. Ah. And, uh, so it was kind of, okay, I pass you, uh, pass you one of mine from my, uh, from my, uh, shelves, and you just return the purple components to me so that I can make a new one. And that new one said, ding! So I gave it to you. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. I have to look for my notes here. Well, apparently I've got one more tune who's got firewall done. I don't have to do it for four days. Wow. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. What is close to Kronos? Maybe I just go over to Deep Space Nine instead. Deep Space Nine is a cool place. And convenient when I'm here in my cooldowns are shot. Let's see. I don't want to visit beautiful Devera. There we go. Even I'll, I'm at the talent. Uh, I love how the curtains. Ooh. 
Let's see where this tune is. Ah, this tune's still got a ways to go. For some reason, it seems to take forever to go from Tier 5 to Tier 6. Rename. Oh, don't take me too far. Guys, guys, no, 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 no. There we go. By the way, if you're going to join us tonight, folks, we are going to be doing swarm and TFOs and working on some of the uh, random uh, TFOs, some planned TFOs and swarms so you can work on Whatever tunes need to be doing swarm and random TFOs, Klingons and uh, Jemmies and a few others. And then Thursday, we're going to do Throwback Thursday and do some of the old stuff. Downstairs went oof. Nope, 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 nope. All right, we're slowly accumulating stuff for this tune. Let's see what else we need. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but there's a dog who lives downstairs, who's normally extremely quiet and absolutely lovely doggy, but I'm hearing him go, woof. However, having moved that stuff over and started all that up, I think it's probably time for me to actually go to work since I didn't go to work yesterday. Uh, I took a sick day. I was not feeling well. I have to learn to occasionally, you know, if my body's going, hey, stay home, you don't feel good, stay home. Especially when it's not time critical to go to work. Oh, shoot, I don't need that, though. So, I'm going to log off for the morning, folks. Please join us tonight at 7 o'clock when we will be playing TFOs and Swarm. And if anybody has some finished infected yep. conduit, I might find one. 
tomorrow I think I will be much less distract distracted from the uh, dressing issues my <laughs> recruit had. <laughs> and my twins are wearing the same outfits from a year ago. I might have changed color on one, but that's it. Nothing else has changed. Because uh, it's, it's like for work, I have five summer shirts, five fall and spring shirts, and five winter sweaters. Three pairs of pants. Same pair of pants for a week, just change the shirts, and it's always the same thing because, you know, then I don't have to think about it. I mean, look at this, student. look at all the stuff she has to wear. All these clothes that's got buckles and straps and shoulder pads and all that. Same sweater and pants. Life is easy. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> All right, so on behalf of Dark Mom Consortium, and specifically on behalf of Mom and Ed in the morning, thanks for joining us. We will see you later. Ed, thank you so much for being here. I mean, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. You oh, just it's a, my pleasure, Mom. Always so good to have you, Ed. Glad you're back. Stick around. Don't don't go away this time. Don't make me scared my anymore. Best. Yeah. All right, everyone, have a great day, and we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Going to stick. Ta-ta.